is some haters in this house. Success haters in this house. When you see them, point them out. When you see them, point them out. So that is the energies of today. Yes. And we got some success haters in the house. These people that wish, that did not wish you well, honey. Now, they want to act like success haters because you're doing better than them. So, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we would like to know about these energies. <clears throat> I didn't shuffle these. Okay, so today's prayer is, You may be strengthened with all power according to His gracious will. Says Colossians 1 11. Okay. So Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we come to you today. We would like to know the energies of these people. These success haters in the house. Yeah, they start this thing off in the seven of swords kind of energy. Yes, these people are trying to get away with things. Yes. These people are living the life of betrayal. They are living the, they are living the life of lies, deceit. This person avoids responsibility at all costs. This person lives on 911 Sneaky Link Lane. Mm. What else is going on with this person? Okay, this person want to be in that temperance energy, but it came in reverse. They have no self-control. There is no balance in their life. They don't have patience. And they don't know why their true meaning of life because they're always in the energy of effing others over. However, yeah. These people are in the two of wands energy. They lack growth. They lack spiritual guidance. They are having difficulties in life. They can't make decisions. And they currently, all of the partnerships that they have made, have unleashed and untangled themselves from this web of lies, this web of deceit that this person has created for themselves. So, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, let's just get right in it. Yes, we would like to know, Holy Spirit, why is these people, why is it some haters in this house? It is some haters in this house, honey. Because you've decided to get rid of all of those people that do not serve you and serve and prioritize your life and get your shit together. That's why it's some haters in this house. It's some haters in this house because they are be trying they are trying to figure out what's your move. How are you winning? They're going to seek tarot cards on you and what your next move is going to be. So if you wanted to know if that person is still living that manipulation life, they are. Yes. They are mad that you are in an instance in the energy of change and constant spiritual growth. This manipulator is mad that none of the hate that they had for you came into fruition they're mad that you're in an energy that you're slaying this spiritual hater so not only is this person a, su a success hater but they are a spiritual hater this person is in an energy of confusion they don't know whether to go right or left. But what they do want to do is say sorry to you, honey. They want to say sorry for abusing you. Hmm. They want to say sorry for manipulating you. And honey, if you think that this manipulation is still here, oh yes, it's still here, honey. Because this person is still in that energy of fuck everyone. 
and their unwanted opinions. So this person do not take criticism well. However, but what they what else they don't take well? These forgotten memories. This person is looking through their phone. This person is still thinking about what you and them had together, honey. And because you don't want to be bothered with them, they're holding grudges, honey. Because you're you have stayed your distance from this hater. So watch your back, darling dear. Because they now want your head on a platter because you don't want to be bothered with them. Yes. Divine feminine, however, is saying that she is in attack mode. This is now her vibe. She's in attack mode, says divine feminine. Don't you get mad at me because I'm doing better than you. Don't you get mad at me because I pulled a you on you. Yes. And I'm doing better than you. Yes. Don't you get mad over here, honey. Because I dodged this bullet. And now that you in that energy of she hurt me, honey. Now you over here playing victim. Fuck your feelings and how you feel. So this is a playing victim card. But Divine Feminine said, fuck your feelings. And fuck your dirty office. I don't want nothing to do with you. Players gonna play, lovers wanna love, I don't even want none of the above, did not get rid of you, yes I do, I got rid of you, I got rid of you, yes, I got rid of you, hater, I sponge my space from you, hater, and your toxic ass family, yes. So, this one is over here living that life where they are mad because they got what they deserve. And that's a she abroad that's living that she devil life. This one is mean. Lives their life in madness. Very spiteful woman. This is the woman that he picked. He picked and this triggers him, darling. Because he now knows that you are the better bitch and he picked a she devil. He picked a broad that's always in a third party fucking you fucking who she fucking everybody and the crew this is a story about minnie the moocha she was a low down hoochie coochie she was the toughest roughest real she had a cooch that was big as a trail the comic is a fucking hoe she is a holy, holy, ho. Yes! And everybody sitting over here gossiping about divine masculine and his ho bitch. Everybody talk about it and he's stressed now. Because he found out that that comic sent her representative, honey. Everybody saying these rumors about these peoples and what they doing and who they screwing. They're living their life over there at Eight twenty-five children of the corn lane they're living their life in total drama honey these haters is going to continue to hate honey this is why divine feminists say i smudged my space yeah from you and your mf and toxic family yeah and I ain't forgot about them fake friends. Yeah, I had to talk to my, had to detox my space from all your lies that you told me. I was living that life of an illusion because I was the big dummy that believed everything you said. So now one is supposed to be feeling sorry for you, hater, because you went with a broad that's your perfect match. Because you listen to your fake ass friends. Mm -hmm. This is the perfect match call. And this is the fake friends call. Yeah. They mad because they listen to their fake friends. Because they thought that the grass was greener on the other side. Mm. But what they found was an attention whore. Mm -hmm. And not only is she a tip. You're in a, a 
attention whore but she's a narcissistic mother to her kids mm-hmm. and he over there living that depressed life cause he got him some old petri dish panties hold up wait this man is a dick dealer I can't stay he better walk he better get the fuck on hey Fuck you and your sorries today. Yeah, let's break it down. This man is over here living that depressed life because he picked a comic. Yeah, he picked one of them Petri dish Patricia Pontes bras. Mm -hmm. And he receiving his karma for fucking you over. Mm -hmm. Receiving his karma for ghosting you darling and now he with somebody but he's still feeling lonely this is why he want to say he's sorry because he now got a psycho bitch that's always in the energy where she wants to fuss and fight and argue this one has mental health concerns so if one wants to know divine feminine is living that life miserable as fuck over here because he see you over here getting your dollars Mm. he know that you deserve better and you can get a better man than him that's an upgrade this is why he envious but divine feminist ain't don't feel that way baby you the one that switched up on me and this is why i'm avoiding your ass So fuck you and your feelings and continue to have a emotional breakdown. Because I have this been disconnected my feelings from your ass. So continue to be salty about that and I'm going to get my hustle on. So stop holding on to me because I don't want you. Stay with Karen. Stay with your current bitch because I'm uninterested. If you like my vibe, like, share, and subscribe.